Triumphant cheers and tears for a hero crossing guard, Carlos Vasquez leaving the hospital, going home after 101 days. For much of that time, he battled for his life. I'm happy I'm alive. Happy I'm alive. What he overcame is profound. In April, Carlos was crossing children at this Glen Cove intersection outside of DZ Elementary School. He was struck by an SUV and airlifted to the hospital in critical condition. To this day, he doesn't remember a thing about the accident. I don't remember anything from the day before till two weeks into here. In that lost time, Carlos battled through brain trauma, coma, and two cardiac arrests. He couldn't know his family, an entire community, and all these school kids were pulling for him. Today, a parking lot of relieved kids showed their love, and the feeling was mutual. I miss watching the kids and, and seeing them every day and crossing with them, and that's what I miss. His family says Carlos is a man of tremendous strength. They had faith in him pulling through. We had all the faith and faith in our friends, community, prayers. Um, have all the faith in him. You have to have the faith in the person. After three months of fighting, this very strong man was overcome. I'm so made to the kids. I'm like, oh, well. <laughs> Doctors say his recovery is remarkable, but Carlos will still have to fight to regain some of his lost mobility. But his goal is to get back to the crossing guard job he loves so much. I'm overwhelmed. I'm very much overwhelmed. It, it's, it's, it's amazing the, the kindness from everybody. From everybody. Like, thank you. Thank you all. John Muller, Pixel 11 News.